Dear friends and fellow hunters, as a hunter, I have to pursue my goal no matter how harsh the weather conditions are or if it's day or night. That's why I have by my side, as part of my equipment, the multifunctional thermal device Viper made by Nighthawk. Let's get to know what the Viper is capable of. A good starting point is the instruction manual that comes with the device. Very often, fellow hunters have asked me questions, the answers to which can be found in the instruction manual. Apart from that, without thoroughly reading the instruction manual, it can lead to improper use of the device that can easily ruin the hunting trip. Let's take a look at how to properly use the Viper thermal imaging device. The device allows to be used both as a thermal monocular in observation mode and as a thermal clip-on that is to be mounted in front of the optical sight. Always check that you are in the correct mode when using it for the intended purpose. Switching between the modes is quick and easy by pressing the last two keys at the same time. When using the device as a thermal clip-on in front of the optical sight, make sure that it is in the corresponding mode. This guarantees that the image is scaled to the field of view of the optical sight. Not only this, but in the incorrect mode, there is a great chance that the actual impact point will be different than the one in the optical sight. Let's look at how to properly mount the Viper on the optical sight of your gun. First of all, make sure that the counter ring is mounted on the thread of the device. Then screw in the appropriate adapter of your optics. The adapter must be properly selected according to the outer diameter of the front lens of your optical sight. Make sure that you have the screw at the appropriate position so that when you lock the clamp, everything fits correctly. When adding the adapter to the device, make sure that the clamp ends up on top of the device. Then using the counter ring, tighten it securely. To place the Viper on the day scope, you need to press it firmly until it meets the body of the optic. Then using the lever, press it and lock it in place securely, like this. Now that we have our safety gear on, we're ready to fire our first control shot. We need to confirm that the device is in clip-on mode. This will ensure accuracy of the shot. Nighthawk, as a manufacturer, guarantees that the actual impact point will deviate no more than 3 centimeters at 100 meters from the zeroing of the day scope. If you want to align your shot 100% to the impact point of the day scope, you can use Viper's alignment function. Alignment is done electronically while being in the settings alignment menu. This is available in clip-on mode only. In position X0, Y0, the image is in the center of the screen of the device. By using the alignment function, the user can move the image in all directions. If the impact point is on the left of the target, the image should be moved to the right, increasing the value of X, and vice versa. If the need of alignment exceeds the limit of 10 steps, please contact your vendor. Now that we have achieved the desired accuracy with the alignment function, the Viper thermal imaging device is ready for use and we can confidently take it on our next hunting trip.